Hello everyone and welcome back to Starbound. My name's TechWorsa and today we're starting on a brand new build. Um, it's a mashup of three different suggestions that I had that seem to go together pretty well. So from TAT, they wanted me to convert the USMC penal colony into an actual colony. I prefer to build it from the ground up, so we're taking Prison Colony from that. We also have Faceless Gamer who suggested an asylum, so in addition to the prison, it's also going to have a insane asylum for the criminally insane. And to finally kind of finish it off, we have Tree Boy who wanted a army colony. Whew. Okay, so that was all the big mouth mouthful. But, so basically we're going to have a USCM army prison. It's going to be a mixture of an army base, a prison, a penal colony, and an insane asylum. It's going to be a little bit of a larger build, so it's going to take me several episodes. Don't know how many, but anyways, we're about to get started. So sit back, relax and enjoy the ride. How are you guys doing today? I hope you're doing well. I just want to say a big thank you for your continuing support and the ideas you've given me for this series. You guys have been absolutely wonderful. Now about this build, this is a barren planet. I chose a barren planet because I figured that a lifeless hunk of rock would be the best place for a prison. So I started off by flattening the ground around where I wanted to start my build. Um, this is important because the uh, the core part of my above ground build is going to be huge. Um, the center part of the structure that I'm working on now is going to be the primary security checkpoint for the prisoners going down into the prison. There's one way into the prison and it's the same as the way out which is the center of a military base. So yeah, I'm starting work on the security doors, which are the nice ones that have like little keyhole lock on them. And that kind of gave me good clearance to have the walls be four thick. I figure that walls that are four thick are going to be more secure and better overall for a style of a prison. And then I make sort of a um, like a security station right above the elevator down where I put a pair of um, computer terminals that have security camera footage on them as well as uh, a security console. And then I build it outward to the sides to connect it to the buildings that are going to be on either side of it. On one side, the side I'm currently working on is going to be a barracks. And the other side is going to be more of an administrative army HQ. Um, I don't really get any big work done on them. I do establish how tall they're going to be. No, towards the end of the video um, right now through the most of the video I do work on getting the security checkpoint looking right um, I add in turrets like you see there I also have a whole bunch of security cameras I fill in the background all those good sort of things and then I spend the rest of the time outlining the barracks the different floors of the barracks make sure that there was plenty of room for um, oh what's it called for the double stacked lunar base bunk beds um, I do plan on for the most part the colonists of this to be um, human guards the tier 2 ones I believe I think I like the tier 2 armor best for humans well for cosmetic purposes at least but yeah, that's what I basically spend the rest of this episode working on is just getting the floors set up for the barracks so 
in the next episode I can get that knocked out pretty quickly and I can finish working on the HQ. Yeah, that's about all I did, really. Oh, I also constructed a skywalk between the two. So basically an even higher up walkway that goes between the top of the two buildings. I figured that would be, well, it's not important since I already have the walkway that goes across the top of the security checkpoint. But I figure more than one walkway would be good enough for this sort of build, you know, extra height advantage and whatnot. Um, okay, so besides these two um, buildings, I do plan on having guard towers surrounding that, and then have like an overflow tent city beyond that. And that's going to be the entire surface of the build. It's going to be a bit sizable. I might actually not have the tent city since it's not necessary. But it's the current idea that I'm kind of working with. Alright, well that's going to be all the time I have for today. Um, so I finished this sort of um, security checkpoint. Well, I still have some decoration to do, but I've finished the outline of it. And I started work on the bunkhouse, or not the bunkhouse, the barracks. And that's going to be it for this video. If you like the video, make sure you hit that like button. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe. I do run a daily-ish Starbound series. Um, if you have any questions, comments, suggestions, concerns, whatever it is, leave it in the comment section down below. Thank you guys so very much for watching, and have yourselves a very good day.